President Rodrigo Duterte is asking for a budget of 20 billion pesos for the office of the president in 2017. This is 600 percent higher than the 2.8 billion peso budget of former President Aquino's office in 2016. Based on the National Expenditure Program of 2017, the confidential expenses and the intelligence expenses of the office of the president increased by 1 billion pesos each. Budget Secretary Ben Diokno says this will be used for the president's war on drugs, criminality and terrorism. There was a request from the president because, you know, he's um, very much actively engaged in the war against terrorism, uh, uh, drugs and criminality. Representation expenses also significantly increased from only 139 million pesos to a massive 7.5 billion pesos. This will fund the representation and transportation allowance of all officials of the office of the president. Yokna explains there are more officials under OP now after Duterte streamlined 12 anti-poverty agencies and placed them under the OP. The professional services expenses also increased by almost 2 billion pesos. This covers the expenses for presidential assistants and consultants of the president. The traveling expenses of the OP also increased from 313 million pesos to 2.1 billion pesos. A lot of uh, foreign travel also. Actually, it's your travel man. Kasama rin ba dito, sir, yung pag-uwi na madalas sa Davao ng presidente? On top of the OP's budget, President Duterte also has discretion over the more than 37 billion peso contingent fund under the Special Purpose Funds. This contingent fund aims to fund items which have not been anticipated during the budget preparation. It is lump sum in nature. Diokna assures the public, though, safeguards are in place to prevent abuse, such as the Commission on Audit, which is tasked to review how these budgets are spent. Joyce Ilas, TNN Philippines. Just how big is the Office of President's Intelligence Fund for 2017 compared with those in the last six years? CNN Philippines Research gathered data from the Budget Department. Intelligence funds during the Aquino administration ranged between half a million to over half a billion pesos. The budget was biggest in 2010 with over 651 million. The majority of that was for confidential and intelligence expenses of the Presidential Anti-Organized Crime Commission, but that still pales in comparison to President Duterte's intelligence fund for 2017, or at least proposed fund, at 2 billion pesos.